The accessories is what gives us the flexibility to use the systems in a lot of different configurations. So for the A6, we have quite a few accessories to support different setups and different cons configurations. And to start with, we have the mini frame. So the mini frame is the part at the very top of the array. So this is what we use to suspend systems. It's a very small and lightweight um, uh, frame, and it can support the weight of, of up to 24 A6s. So you can rig up to 24 A6s on this mini frame. And it has a very nice and small compact footprint for storage. It's also very flexible in terms of configurations. So you can use it on a single point, dual point, and also reverse the frame. Sometimes we have to trim the system low and point very far up. And in those situations, we have to be able to reverse the frames. So the mini frame is reversible and very flexible in terms of number of points used. That same mini frame is also compatible with the B15. So the B15s on the outside of the A6s are also suspended using, using mini frames. So the same frame can do both the A6 and the B15. And we also have a truss clamp. So in some situ situations, you don't have the budget or the trim height for a motor, and you want to attach the systems directly to the trussing. For, so for those situations, we have this thing that we call the RC500. So this is a, a mechanism to attach frames directly to trussing and then skip the motors altogether. So this connects directly to the mini frame on the, on the spreader bar and then gives you the option to do up to 500 kilos worth of weight on a truss. So this is really good for trade shows, smaller applications, or again, in this situation where we could, we could have skipped the fly point and do the entire array on the RC500. We also have a suspension bar. So this suspension bar it can be attached to the bottom of the array. Sometimes we have to create very curved arrays and trim them very, very high to get, uh, let's say, out of camera views and things like that. So the suspension bar can be connected to the very back of the system and gives us another fly point at the very back to create this curved arrays. And it can also attach the top of the A6. So depending on the configuration and the situation, we can skip the mini frame and suspend an A6 array completely on suspension bars. And that same suspension bar is also compatible with the B15. It can be used in a variety of different configurations. So again, the accessories are flexible, and they're also compatible across the uh, different products within the line. Now, a, a lot of times, we don't have the option to suspend systems. So I know in India specifically, this can be a big requirement where we can ground stack the, the systems. So for that, we have this accessory we call the base plate. So the base plate is an accessory that allows the uh, A6 has to be ground stacked on any subwoofer with an M20 attachment at the top. So in situations where we need to ground stack the systems, uh, we can use this base plate and ground stack up to eight A6s on top of subwoofers. So the picture over here shows our B28, uh, but the same base plate, the exact same part, is compatible with the B18s and the B15s. So that gives us a very flexible solution and yet another way to deploy the system for a different application where uh, fly points are not available. And then building onto that flexibility and expandability, that same base plate can also be used with another accessory we have, we call the VTX pole mount. So at the bottom of the base plate, there is two M10 positions, and we can attach on those this accessory we call the pole mount, and that gives us the option to put that base plate on traditional uh, speaker stands or poles, and that would give us the option to uh, use up to three A6s in this configuration. So that gives you, again, an idea of the flexibility and in how many different ways we can use that same system. So the goal is to have as, as many of the same product in the inventory as possible, and then using these accessories, deploy them in different configurations. For transportation, A6s go four in carts. So we make, make uh, in cases, so we make our own case for this. So this case can hold up to four A6s. And it also has room internally for one mini frame, one base plate, and one suspension bar. So one case can house all the accessories. Uh, so the, depending on the situation, you can just send the case, and then you have everything needed to either suspend or ground stack the system in that one case. <coughs> 